Completely good? I'll tell you for you. See, in parallel connection, the resistors will be inserted in between two ends. The resistors will be inserted in between two ends. The current will be different, but the potential different will be the potential will be same, but the current will be different. Okay. Okay. Thank you, friend. Ah, thank you, thank you. Okay. So we have learned about Ohm's law. Depending upon the Ohm's law, there are two connections. The first one is series connection. The first one is series connection. So according to series connection, what is we, what we learn that equivalent resistance is equal to R1 plus R2 plus R3. What we have learned that equivalent resistance is equal to R1 plus R2 plus R3. So these type of series connections are helpful in Christmas uh, Christmas decorating, Deepavali decora decoration, and also how to decorate our homes homes. Okay. So the next one is parallel connection. So in parallel connection, what we have learned that one by equivalent resistance. Hello. Ah. Uh, Hello. Hi Rose. friend. Hi friend, and who is this? Can you please? I am Shobha Seru from Vikarabad. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, tell me, Shobha, what's your doubt? Yeah, resistance means oppose the flow of electrons. Yes. Right. If uh, oppose the flow of electrons, how the current will pass through the circuit? Yeah, I'll tell you that. Yeah. If the current always uh, passes, what will happen for the certain bulb? We need resistance. Uh, for the certain bulb, we we need what we need. We need current. For this, we need current. No. If it always flows like this, what will happen? There will be no current. So the resistance will opposes the electrons to give certain current to this bulb. So did you understood? Yes. Did you understood my question? Okay. So the resistance, what will do? It opposes the flow of electrons. For that, it will get the current. It will have the same current to each and everything. Okay. So in parallel connection, what we have learned that e one by equivalent resistance is equal to one by R one plus one by R two plus one by R three. Okay. This type of parallel connection will use in household so that there is no. A waste of electricity because nowadays the electricity is very main purpose. It is using it, we are using electricity in many fields. No, for that yeah, electricity is very important. So that we what we are using we are using parallel connection so that there is no waste of electricity. Okay, the next one what we have learned see here. Okay, hello. Hello. Hello, who is this? I'm from I'm from Nanmar School. Ah yes, tell me, friend. What's your question? From Karim Karimnagar district. Okay, friend, tell me. Give example for equivalent resistance in series and parallel. Connection. Okay. See here in parallel connection. Give example. Once again, please repeat your question, please. Yes. Please repeat your question, please. Give example. Okay. For equivalent resistance in series. In series. Yes. And parallel connection. Okay, in series, what we are seeing, equivalent resistance means we are seeing street lights. No, see here, we are seeing street lights. No, these are the example for equivalent resistance because the first one will glow. This uh, the same amount will be will be glowed uh, in the next light. And for the parallel, we are seeing household. Okay, the household. The bulbs get the equivalent resistance. Equivalent resistance is nothing but the sum of all the uh, potential difference is equal to the individual resistance. Okay, did you understood? Hello. Hello, Saro. Hello, Saro. Good afternoon. I'm, good afternoon, Saro. I'm ah. Shalya from Eklara Nizam District. Okay. Question is which connect is conjures more electricity? 
Yeah, I'll tell you. Ah, for which consumes the more current? For the series connection, we have to give more. Uh, yes, because uh, it's have only one path. No, to if you see, it's having uh, less connection, so it's glowing a uh, little bit. So we have to give uh, equal equal more current to series connection. Okay, till now your doubts are so so good. Hello. Hello, who is this? Can you please? Hello. Hello. Yes. We are from Ibrahim Patna, madam. Yeah. Okay. Tell me. So we want to ask question. Okay. Ask. In which type of connection the bulb glow brightly? In which of uh, okay, I'll tell you. In parallel connection, the bulb will glow more because here in series connection they have to share. Okay, they have to share the current. But in parallel connection, there is no share of uh, current. If you switch on this, there will be glow. Okay, it have individual current flows. So in parallel connection, we have uh, we have more brightness. Okay. Did you uh, got my point, Sparrow? Sparrow, did you got my point? And also, in which connection the potential is divided? In which connection the potential is di uh, divided? In series connection, the potential is divided. Okay, because the V1 V is equal to V1 plus V2 plus V3. The potential difference is different, but the current is single. Why? Because here we are seeing the current is passing through only. There is only one way for the flow of current, but the potential difference is different for different resistors. Okay, did you got my point, Swaro? Good question. You are really good. You are clever too. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. Okay, Swaros. Ah, uh, now we got the point. That was Omla, Omsla, and also, hello, hello. Who is this? Good afternoon. Hello, this is Navya. Hi, Navya. This is Navya from Mahindra Hills. Oh, ah, uh, okay. Ah, uh, what Tell is the unit of potential difference? What? Can you please? Can you please once one more what time? What is it? Can you please? What is the unit of potential difference? Yeah, I'll tell you. For the current, I, we have for the potential difference also. Difference. The unit is volt. What is volt? And for the current, it is ampere. It is ampere. And for the resistance. That is ohms. Okay, ohm like this. Did you got my point, Navya? Okay, Sparrows. Yeah, okay, Sparrows. See here, the the units of current is ampere, and for the potential difference, it is volt, and for the resistance, it is ohm. Observe here; these are all the scientists' name. Okay, okay, Sparrows. This this is a basic this type like. Current, what is current and what is potential difference, and also what is series connection, parallel connection, Ohm's law. This is the basic for every physics subject because in future we have to write many of. Hello, 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 Swaro. Good afternoon. Okay. These are the basics what we have to learn because in competitive exams we will have the series connection, parallel connection, and what is Ohm's law. These are the basics for tenth, first year, and also second year, so that we can also get many marks in the competitive exams. So I'll tell you again. Hello. 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 Good afternoon. Ah, uh, hello. Good afternoon. Ah, uh, yes. Tell me. I am the I am from the Tarakol Nizamba district. Okay, Swaro. I want to ask the one question for you. O okay. So, what is the units of resistance? Yeah, the units of resistance is ohm. 
the units of resistance is ohm ohm resistance is ohm and for potential difference difference what for the potential difference it is volt and for the current i is equal to what ampere okay so i did you got my point good question it's really good it is very important to know the units of a uh, units because in higher uh, higher classes we will have sums depending upon the units ok. And so, it is very important for every student to know what is the physics and because ok, uh, what is physics and uh, depending on physics there are many. You are watching me in front of uh, in front of TV that is only because of physics, without physics is it impossible? Nothing, our surrounding is physics everything is physics everything depends upon the physics so it is very important to know what is physics and it's very important to to also to know what is the uh, uh, basics uh, basics for the physics so never ever neglect the physics subject i really love physics and i hope you people would like my uh, in, in would like my lesson and you you must learn something from Ohm's law and also a resistance series and parallel connection. So, thank you and uh, remember me, this is your friend Manish Faro from Mind Rails. Thank you for listening my, my lesson so, peace, uh, uh, so peacefully. Thank you.